picture this. Millions of undocumented immigrants could soon face an unprecedented barrier to achieving that dream. As former President Donald Trump has a bold plan to ban mortgages for undocumented immigrants. Now, this proposal has sparked intense debate, leaving many wondering about what this means for the future of home ownership in America. Well, you're watching Times XP and I'm Prithi Autry. So, in recent speech, former President Donald Trump made a huge announcement. That is about what he would do if elected in 2024 again. His plan? Well, that's to stop the undocumented immigrants from being able to get a home mortgages in the United States. Trump made this statement during a talk at the Economic Club of New York. He said that undocumented immigrants, which he claims that the number is about 21 million, are part of a reason housing costs have gone up. Now, he argues that banning them from getting a home loan would help lowering the prices for everybody else in the country. However, on the other hand, experts don't see this plan making a huge difference. According to the Urban Institute, only about 5,000 to 6,000 undocumented immigrants were given mortgages last year. Now, in comparison, over 3.4 million mortgages were handed out to all the buyers in 2023. So, basically, the number of undocumented people getting home loans is actually pretty small. Now, housing costs have been a major, major issue, specifically since home prices and mortgages rates shot up during the pandemic. Trump believes that his plan could actually work, but others aren't really sure about it. Affordable housing advocates and real estate experts say that banning mortgages for the undocumented immigrants particularly won't make a big impact on lowering the prices. Again, in this announcement, uh, which is a part of Trump's larger agenda, he also blames undocumented immigrants for various problems. And now he is pointing fingers at him for housing unaffordability crisis. At the very same time, another political figure are offering different solutions. For example, Democratic presidential candidate Kamala Harris wants to help first-time home buyers by offering them $25,000, that is in assistance for the down payment. Meanwhile, Trump also announces another plan if he is elected. He wants to create a government efficiency commission. And he said he have had Elon Musk led it. Now, the goal would be to cut federal spending and make the government run more smoothly. Currently, President Joe Biden has proposed granting legal status and path to citizenship to up to 5 lakh undocumented spouses of the United States citizen. That's a really big move. Now, in California, there's even talk of a plan that would help the undocumented immigrants get taxpayer assistance to buy homes. So, basically, while Trump's proposal is causing a stir, there are a lot of different ideas out there about how to handle the housing and immigration. For more such videos, do follow Times XP.